Turning now to a Target 12 investigators exclusive. Some residents in a newly constructed neighborhood in Coventry say this happens to their homes and yards regularly. We're talking about flooding. And now they've filed multiple complaints with the state looking for help. Target 12 investigator Kate Wilkinson joins us now to explain. Kate. Residents say it only takes a small amount of rain for their backyards to flood. They argue the developer has not fixed the problem, so they've gone to the attorney general for help. I do have water coming in. David Chamberlain says he's had problems since he bought his home here on East Shore Drive in Coventry. So as weeks and months went on with all the rain, it's flooding, flooding, flooding. No action. Basement's getting wet. His home was built in 2022 by North Kingstown-based D2 Homes. The company's owner, Robert Dubloy, did not respond to Target 12's request for an interview. Chamberlain says Dubloy initially told him he would fix the foundation, but says after conversation stalled, Chamberlain decided to fix it himself. I personally spent $20,000 this summer on installing my own drain system. According to the state's Department of Business Regulation, five complaints have been filed against D2 Homes. One of those complaints remains active, but four were determined to be beyond the scope of the contractor's registration and licensing board. If I wanted a river in my backyard, I would have looked for a piece of property where it was a standing river in my backyard, not wait for it to rain. Next door neighbor Albert Schiavone says his backyard also sees excessive flooding but says a drain installed by the developer hasn't helped much. It's still left high and dry and, you know, anytime it rains, we panic. The homeowners went to the town after noticing some parts of the home were not inspected, like the building backfill, which is when construction crews fill an excavated area to ensure stability and drainage. In a statement, the town acknowledges flooding in the neighborhood is a problem, but all 33 homes in the neighborhood passed all proper safety inspections, writing, the building official feels all of the residents he provided certificate of occupancies to are safe. The debate currently is who is responsible for the drainage issues that most of the neighborhood is suffering from. The town manager's office says they are in talks with D2 Homes and have been over the last several months to fix the problem. Last check, the town manager says there have been no developments. Now some of the residents have gone to the attorney general's office for help. I bought the house to have no problems because I do my own construction. I'd rather come home and not do nothing. Instead, I'm doing a lot. <laughs> And a spokesperson for the attorney general's office says those complaints are open and are actively being addressed. Shivani says he has not heard back from Deploy since April of 2023. Live with the Target 12 investigators, Kate Wilkinson, 12 News.